Alphonse Cirillo a member of the Colombo crime family connected to the Profasi criminal family under Joseph Magliocco's rule, was the father of Dominic Cirillo, who was born on July 4, 1929, in East Harlem. Alphonse an immigrant from Potenza, Basilicata, Italy, is thought to have attempted to kill Lawrence Gallo, Joseph Gallo's brother, in 1961. Lawrence Gallo is a member of the Profasi crime family. However, due to Gallo's failure to cooperate, no charges were filed against Alphonse or his alleged cohorts Carmen Persico and Salvatore D'Ambrosio. According to one early 1960s organized crime mob family chart, Alphonse managed to live a life in organized crime without ever being arrested for any criminal behavior other than being accused of criminally receiving. After his death, he became well known because Joseph Valachi, a mob turncoat, mentioned him together with a large number of other organized crime personalities in his testimony. Dominic, who grew up in East Harlem, left school as a teenager and briefly pursued a career as a professional middleweight boxer after engaging in amateur boxing at neighborhood youth clubs. He was a hefty man, standing at 5 feet 10 inches and weighing around 200 pounds in the 1990s. Vincent Higante, a close friend and criminal associate since their early years, later became the heir to the Genovese crime family, in which Dominic was involved. Throughout his life, Dominic faced various legal issues. In 1949 as a 20-year-old welterweight, he retired from boxing after being knocked out in three matches and drawing one. At the age of 23 in 1953, he pleaded guilty to managing a clandestine heroin trafficking ring, allegedly making up to $20,000 a day. This led to a nearly four-year sentence at the Federal Correctional Institution in Milan, Michigan. He married an Italian-American woman named Bella, with whom he had two children, Nicholas and Anne-Marie. Due to his criminal associations, fellow associates developed a secret sign language to refer to Dominic without drawing attention. He claimed to be a retired construction worker living off of $510 per month in social security checks. Dominic resided in the country club section of the Northeast Bronx, close to Pelham Bay Park in Eastchester Bay.